Hi everyone, this is Caleb from Kid App Reviews, and today we're going to be taking a look at a really cool app called Preschool Connect the Dots Game. Now this is a really fun Connect the Dots game that's very educational and has lots of functionality, lots of cool illustrations and sounds, and just all around just a, a great app. So from the main screen here, you can see we can start playing it or we have some settings. Um, I'll go and get into the settings a little bit later because I want to show you the gameplay right now. So here on this screen you see a series of dots and they all have a letter of the alphabet inside them and you have to tap the re the, the right, like the first letter of the alphabet you're, you're going, you're counting up from A to Z. So I tap A, a B, C, D, start connecting e, them. F, G, H, I. J K L M N O P Q R S Just like that. Elephant. So after I successfully connected the dots, I got to see a cool you know, illustration appear and then have the announcer say the animal's name and I get to hear really cool sound effects. So it's very fun to do this. There's lots of things to see in here. So now we have numbers now. One, two, three, four, five, six. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. Also, the audio is really clear and nice as well. Dolphin. So that's how uh, the connected dots game works. You know, pretty simple and easy. Like you, like I was showing you, you can drag, kind of like you're drawing it, or you can just tap the dots in the right order, so you can go like A, B, C. You can do that as well. Okay, well, let me go back to the settings now. Right here, and this is a really cool part of the app is the uh, amount of options you can change, and uh, really gives you a lot of fine control over this app. So here you can choose whether you want numbers to be displayed, upper, lowercase, uh, letters, um, allow the drawing, like I was saying, you know, you, if you want your kids to draw the dots or you want them just to tap. You can set that there. If you want them to display, the app to display words, uh, the voice um, for the words and the voice for you know, the numbers and letters, and also some other features like the category of objects, which are, I think this is really cool. You can choose, you want just, you know, vehicle, transportation, um, objects or food items or animals. So it's really nice. You can just come in here and choose what you want. So if you want your kids just to learn about, you know, food and different kinds of fruits and vegetables, well, you can just come in here and say, just show food. Really cool. Also, another nice feature I really like is the difficulty setting here. So if you have a younger, you know, toddler just learning their letters and numbers, they might kind of have a hard time, you know, knowing which letter to start with or how to connect the dots in the right way. Well, an easy mode, when, uh, it'll give them a little hint, like the next dot they need to go to will be highlighted with this little yellow ring around it. And so it helps them to know which order they go to next and also helps them learn. Then the normal mode, when they get a little better, it doesn't instantly show them which dot to go to, but it waits a few seconds and lets them keep trying. And then after a few seconds, it then highlights the one they should go to next. So it's not as, um, it doesn't instantly show this dot. It lets them try to figure it out themselves before it tells them. Then you have hard mode, which then doesn't give you any hand. You just have to really know your stuff. So I like that flexibility to be able to choose. And another thing I should mention is that if your child, you know, the language is in English, well, you can still have fun with this app and you can turn off the words like, you know, don't display the word, don't do the, uh, the voice over. And if you want to turn off maybe the alphabet, just have numbers and just enjoy the illustrations. So when I go back, hit play, you can still have fun playing this app. So even if you don't speak English, you can still enjoy the illustrations and the sound effects and just having fun, you know, with numbers and connecting the dots. So a really cool feature that you can uh, do in this application. 
Well, that's it for uh, Preschool Connect the Dots game. Great app. Really well designed. This is actually from the creators of another great app called Shape Builder, which is an Apple Store favorite and one of their essentials. So you know this app is high quality because of the creators of Shape Builder, which is a really great app that I also recommend you check out too if you if you already haven't. And also the, the audio in this game is so well done that you can play it in really noisy and loud environments and crank it up on here and it'll still sound good. It won't get all distorted and nasty sounding. So your kid can still enjoy this in any kind of environment they're in. Well, that's it for this review. Thanks for watching and we'll see you here next time at Kid App Reviews.